Hey, Danny Bayoun, Realtor with EWM Realty International. Today, my partner and I, Maria Velasco, would like to speak to you about Weston's premier community, Savannah, and the latest market updates. Is our current market shifting and the latest rent to buy report truly explain the home ownership remains cheaper than renting with a traditional 30 year fixed rate mortgage in the 100 largest metro areas in the United States? Pursuant to a recent article by Zillow.com, nationally home values will appreciate by 4.5% over the course of 2016, 3.6% in 2017, and about 3.2% in the next two years, and finally 2.9% in 2010. That means the average annual appreciation will be 3.5% over the next five years. Median home values in Fort Lauderdale, Miami increased 9.3% last year. This increase puts the median home value at around $237,300. Mortgage rates will continue to hover around all-time lows with the 30-year fixed rate, mortgage averaging 3.43% the last week of August 2016. This marks the ninth consecutive week that mortgage rates have been below 3.5% says Sean Piketty, Freddie Mac's chief economist. Markets are erring on the side of caution ahead of the second estimate for the second quarter GDP and Fed Chair Janet Yellen's speech on Friday. Recent research by Realtor.com examined certain red flags that caused the housing crisis in 2005 and compared them to today's real estate market. Price to rent ratio, price to income ratio, mortgage transactions, house flipping, Home prices were way above normal ratios when compared to both rent and incomes at that time. Mortgage transactions as a percentage of all home sales were also at a higher percentage. House flipping was rampant in 2005. The table below reflects the unrealistic ratios and numbers of 2005 as compared to the current market. Remember, a negative percentage reflects a positive gain for the market. Take a look at this chart. What about Weston? We currently have 7.2 months of supply, wherein six to nine months is a balanced market. This, month's last, this month last year, there was only 3.6 months of supply, an increase of 72.3%. Even with rising inventories, Weston is barely in the balanced market strata. The average sold price per square foot hovers around $202 and is up 2.5% compared to last year. The average list price is $925,000, up 1.1% over last year, while the average sold price is $504,000, down 8.7% over last year. Homes currently stay on the market about 54 to 60 days. If your home is priced compellingly, especially in Weston and surrounding areas, it will sell within a 60 day time frame or less, as long as your realtor has marked your home consistently digitally, via social media, through print media. Is the market shifting? Well, according to experts, we're not heading towards any bubble. The recent Zika scare has affected our local market more than global economies or even the upcoming election has. The market is steadying, however, and prices may level as lenders continue to scrutinize loans and work within the new federal guidelines. While prices have steadied, now would be a great time to entertain selling your home. So thank you for joining us. Tune in next week for another segment of Savannah's Real Estate Market Update. And remember, keep the faith. Oh, Donnie. Oh, coming.